Hello everybody, this is Nick with Top Automotive again. I got a Ferrari 599 here behind me. And I want to talk a little bit about what pressure bleeding is when we usually tell customers, hey, we need to pressure bleed your brakes. They kind of don't understand the concept. Uh, it's very simple and I'm gonna pretty much demonstrate it right here. Here, brake line hooked up. This is actually open and there's actually pressure being applied at the pressure bleeder, which we'll get to in a minute. But what we're doing is we're gonna bleed the inside and outside of the calipers. We're gonna bleed the whole system. You really wanna do this every year. It doesn't matter what the miles are, especially on the Ferrari. You don't wanna wait until you get moisture and all this. But this is very important setup here because you don't wanna get brake fluid, especially if these are carbon ceramic. These brakes are a fortune. You know, the rotors are more expensive than some cars. All right, let's go to the front. Okay, so we have a pressure bleeder connected to the brake reservoir here. And the way it works is we pressurize it to 15 PSI and we actually will send in, this is gonna be race brake fluid, specifically designed for this Ferrari. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna then allow the fluid, we'll top it off if we need to, but usually it takes about a liter to bleed the whole system. And you have this little valve here that connects. You open this piece here and then it starts to bleed itself. I mean, it's pretty much kind of almost self-bleeding, but if you don't hook it up right, but the best part is when you hook it up properly, you really can't get air in the system. Uh, you can also help out with the pedal as you're bleeding. There's also a procedure for electronic, ble like electronic bleeding when you actually go into the Ferrari menu. Uh, they do have a procedure to activate the ABS pump. Since we didn't have the system open, we're just doing a maintenance service, we don't need to do none of that. Now, if you had the system open, then at Ferrari or a specialty shop like ours that did the work on a car and the ABS unit was removed and there were some lines disconnected or even calipers, you really want to get into the Ferrari ABS system and activate the pump and then bleed, activate the pump. There's a whole process for that because you won't get the air out even with the pressure bleed. This is just for maintenance. So this is pretty much what Ferrari would do. This is how they're going to normally uh, achieve the bleeding is with this. And I'm going to show you a couple other things in a second here. Look at this massive rotor. I mean, this thing's amazing. I didn't price one of these out yet because we don't have to replace them, but it's right around, I believe, close to $10,000 plus or minus. Uh, this caliper and every caliper that we bleed, we bleed in a specific order. So we are going from the furthest from the reservoir, and then we're going to the second furthest from the reservoir, and so forth. Then we get to the front. We're going to go on that side, and then we're going to go back to the front left. And, and that's pretty much how you bleed the system. This is how we do it, and just kind of wanted to go over the steps that are taken and get all the confused uh, customer confusion out of this thing. So this is pretty much how you do it. Again, I uh, just want to thank you guys for watching. And uh, if you have any questions, comment below, subscribe. We really appreciate it. Have a nice day.